Hello everybody, this is Runway34Right, and I'm here to give you a tutorial on how to install repaints into FSX. Um, this tutorial is um, probably more for beginners, because I'm sure um, lots of advanced users um, know how to install repaints, but this will... Um, knowing how to install repaints really allows you to expand the uh, default aircraft as well as... Um, any add-on aircraft that you might um, get just allows you to expand farther past you know the pack that you get you know anyway so um, what I'm going to be using is just the default 737-800 which is you know basically just want to keep it real low level for this one I'm going to be using a KLM repaint I haven't ever used this repaint before so I'm not sure but all I went to is uh, I went to flightsim.com now for flight sim you need to have a um, account it's totally free just go to um um where uh wherever you log in or sign up or something okay just sign up get a flight sim account free it's my favorite website to download uh files and stuff anyway i just went to the basic file search um fsx all files and i typed in 737 klm that's all i need to type in press enter and all I did was scroll down and I found the this one which is at the bottom of the first page I clicked download accepted and I downloaded it but I already have it downloaded so let's just exit out of this okay well alright I have the file on my desktop right here and um okay I'm gonna extract this right click extract all I'm just gonna press extract to my desktop don't need to make any changes at all um, now you'll find this folder in here, and this is the texture.klm folder. Okay, just open that, see what's in it. Um, now take this folder, right-click on it, and extract that, and um, just delete all this part. This is what you don't necessarily need to do this for all textures, but um, I'm just doing it for this one, just to make it a little bit easier. And I just have texture. KLM on here and here it is that's our that's our texture right there uh, no okay um well anyway I have that here and also and I'm gonna need to open this up because in the readme is something very important this right here if you know about flight sim a lot then you'll know what this is if you don't bear with me here this part is important Okay, anyway, just close that out. All you need is really the README. Anyway, so um, you're going to want to go into your FSX main file. Well, sim objects, but go to your main file first. That'd be helpful. Just go to Computer, Local Disk C, Program Files x86. If you have 64-bit, um, if you have 32-bit, it'll be in Program Files, but I have 64-bit. So we'll go into here, Microsoft Games, which I'm... Cl Microsoft Games, Flight Simulator X, which I'm clicking on now. Um, sound thing, sorry. Um, sim objects, airplanes, where is it? Okay, 737, 800. Now, this is extremely simple. All you're going to have to do is go into texture, drag texture.klm, make sure this is the right one with no other folders in it. Texture KLM, drag it into 737, 800 folder. And that's it. That's all there is to it, but you're not really installed yet. Okay, uh, there's still some stuff you need to do. Okay, now you're gonna open that readme file. Remember, I said that this part was really important. Well, uh, I didn't lie. It is. So you're gonna want to go down to um, right at the bottom of the description. Just uh, get everything that I have highlighted in blue up, up from, and including the top line, flight sim X, starting with that down to description, including all of that right click click on copy and you want to go into the aircraft CFG file if um, you want to know more about this file um, it'd be helpful to know just um, go to my other video click on the nose of the 747 right there just click on it and um, you'll go to my other video well anyway uh, once again as I always say just um, if you can't open this if you just have like a blank file here right right click open with and click on notepad in other programs and you'll be able to open all these 
all the CFG files with Notepad. So, all right, you see this Flight Sim Zero. These are basically just the texture files telling Flight Sim wh what to do with the textures. Scroll down, right above General. Okay, now click between General and last one. Press Enter a few times just to give yourself a little room. Click there, right click, and paste. I have that in there. Almost done, not yet. Now find the tile we have here before. This isn't only for the default 737. This is also for any other things. It could be um um remember they always start at zero. That's something to remember. So you have to number these in sequence in order them for sh to show up right. So flight some zero, one, two, etc., etc. So just find the last one that you have here. It could be five. It could be zero, it could be 200, it doesn't matter. Some people have lots of space on their computers. <laughs> so, just find the previous one, flightsim.5, go back here, and type in 6, the ne which is the next number in sequence. Um, it says this in the readme instructions, but um, it's just a lot of, you know, I interpreted that when I first learned how to do this as just put in any number, so I just put in I don't know, that, and it didn't show up. I, w I wondered why, but that's because it didn't put in sequence. That's the important part. Well, anyway, um, I'd explain more about this whole thing right here, but that's not the point of this tutorial. This is just how to install textures. So, um, all right, just exit out of that, press save, and voila! That's it. Fin, you're done. That is your 737 texture for uh, KLM, um, default 737-800. Once again, click on my um, video, the link's right here, again, on those 747 if you missed it. Um, so yeah, that's how to install tutorial, not tutorial, that's a tutorial, I'm sorry, on how to install the default 737 into the default 737 texture, and just a general texture thing in general. So, thank you very much for watching, rate, comment, subscribe, tell me what I can do better. Uh, tell me what you like about my videos. Thank you very much for watching. Happy flight simming, collecting, etc., etc. Goodbye. Thank you.